All right. Uh, so this is part three of uh, New Game Plus guide for Batman Arkham Origins. Uh, so this video is the only two of the comms tower that I'm uh, not deactivating, but um, unhacking, I guess. Unjamming is what I'm doing. Mainly because they're story related, and, you know. But I kind of said at the end of the last video, but um, outside really of these two comm towers, I'm not really going out of my way to to unjam the other towers. Mainly because the only thing they really accomplish is unlocking the fast travel and making it easier to find the the comm relays that you need to destroy to uh, bring down Nigma's uh, network. Um, which I really don't give a shit about since uh, it's all really just side quest shit that you don't really need to do on New Game Plus. You can just do it on just a, on your normal playthrough. So I didn't see the point of going through the bullshit of all that. Uh, now the other thing coming up here is that the investigation... Uh, here and then the later one at Lacey Towers. I'm not real. Well, the Lacey Tower ones I do show. This one I cut out the investigation mainly because there's no strategy to it. Uh, the game shows you everything you need to look for. The only thing, the only point when you have to find Sun is when you're rewinding through the footage to find like where a certain item was. But for this one, the thing that you need to find is the the key card that's in the vent, and you just have to keep rewinding it until eventually the grate lights up so you can open it. So, I just didn't see the point of including it since no strategy needed to it and it just wastes the time of the video and the viewer. So, uh, in the case of the Lacey Towers one, that whole investigation takes like six minutes, but the way the mission goes. I couldn't really cut it out because it just made the video transition poorly. So what I just end up doing in that one, I just sped up the footage of the entire investigation. So it's all there. It's just at like like 4x speed or whatever the top speed uh, Sony Vegas has. Um, I basically just slid the speed of it all the way all the way over until I couldn't you know put it anymore so figured I'd get that shit out of the way now even though I'll probably talk about that uh, when we actually get to that video and like I said before like depending on how far the travel is to like point A to point B if it's really fucking far I'm just cutting it out uh, for the flow of the video and just because it's really not necessary to waste the time. Uh, so what I did right there was um, when I had the dive attack on the guy by pressing right trigger I sped up the strike so I basically took out one guy already. Um, so this fight was kind of a 
pain in the ass for me because I actually ended up dying during it. Um, because of shit like that, where some guy just got like a sucker punch in on me. Um, so, yeah, it's, it sucks. Uh, and it's all points where I'm clearly hitting the Y button to counter, but I guess the movement that Batman is doing, the game decides that, oh, even though you're hitting counter, he can't actually counter the move so you don't get hit which is the only thing I can figure is that even though I'm clearly hitting counter when I should uh, Batman is just doing a move that for whatever reason he can't actually counter the hit that's coming at him yeah, that's the only thing I can figure don't, don't. Whatever you're gonna do, don't. so I don't know, it's the, like, I've always had a problem with the combat system in all the Batman games, so, you know, like I said, if you've watched my Arkham City Guide, then you, you know how, not terrible I am at the combat, but how average I am at it, I guess is the best way I can describe it, so. So after that thing, uh, we have to find, I think it's two SIM cards, so we can figure out where the hell the penguin is, even though we, if you've already played the game once, which I, I'm assuming if you're watching this guy, you have played the game once already. Um, he's at his... I think it's called the final offer I think is the name of the the ship um, anyway here yeah, I kind of got lost because I went completely around uh, where the guy was or where the location was um, so yeah see like this battle it has a heavy or uh, an a sh armored guy and the riot shield guy and the first time going through this fight, I don't even think the the armored guy was in this fight. I think it was just a bunch of thugs. So this is that moment where it's like, well, so not only are we giving them weapons, but you know what? We're gonna throw a shield guy in there just to fuck with you, because why not? It's new game plus, and. And it's always annoying too, because anytime during these fights where the ride shield guy is there, I always have a combo going, and then the direction Batman goes will usually be towards the shield guy. So I just waste a shot punching the ride shield and just fuck up the combo I had going. Which is something, I think that happens like two other fights from the footage that I've recorded so far um, but yeah the rest of this video is just uh, unjamming this tower and I will see you in uh, the next part Why are you doing this, Enigma? 